The scriptures did not mention what happened to David when the Holy Spirit came upon him. The scripture said Saul prophesied with the prophets when he received the Spirit. On the day of Pentecost, everyone who received the Spirit spoke in tongues. So far, everyone who received the Holy Spirit had their own personal experience. Religion have complicated the words of the Most High. Because the Satans use the workers of iniquity to infiltrate the scriptures, the spirit of confusion is able to deceive many people in and out of the awakening. One of the doctrines that come from Rome is that when you receive the Holy Spirit, you must speak in tongues. There must be evidence of you speaking in tongues. I've never read in the scriptures where King David or King Saul had to show proof they were filled with the Spirit of the Most High. When Peter was speaking to the people as a witness of the Messiah, he said to the people, Repent and be baptized in Yahshua for remission of sins. Peter said to the people they would receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Peter went on to say the Holy Spirit is a promise to them and their children as well as for the future generations and to as many as the Most High shall call. 